A pregnant mom and her partner were surprised that they were expecting triplets, but they were in for another big surprise when they discovered they were having not just three but four babies. Dad passed out in the delivery room, overwhelmed with emotion. Any baby is a blessing, and this particular couple got an abundance of blessings all at the same time when they discovered that they were having triplets. Weeks later, they found out that they weren't expecting just three additions to their suddenly big family before. There's a 700,000 to 1 chance of pregnancies carrying quadruplets that are all girls, and Gemma Robson and her partner Andy Rain just so happened to beat that chance. The couple had no idea what to expect during their routine 12-week pregnancy scan. They were simply excited to see their baby, only to be stunned when the doctor announced they were having triplets. Discovering that they had triplets was already a big deal for them. They prepped themselves to become parents of three right away, only to have yet another big surprise during their 17-week scan. During the scan, a fourth baby was nestled comfortably in Gemma's womb. After hearing the news, Andy admitted that he nearly fainted, sharing, I couldn't believe it when we were told we were having quadruplets, and I nearly fainted. Gemma and Andy had several weeks to prepare themselves for the coming of their four kids. While it took a while to grasp the idea, all their worries disappeared after their baby's births. It's an amazing feeling to now see them here, Andy said. Before getting to such a state, Gemma and Andy first had to go through their harrowing delivery. While Gemma was due in December, the quadruplets entered the world earlier than expected when Gemma went into labor on November 18. Initially, Gemma thought it was just getting crowded inside her womb with four little girls moving around. However, the morning after, she realized it was more than that when she couldn't stand up due to constant contractions. After a doctor checked on her, it was decided that Gemma needed to undergo an emergency C-section, and her girls were born the following morning. The ordeal was challenging for Gemma, but she had no time to process everything that was happening. Because they were born premature, they were placed under neonatal care and were to stay in the neonatal intensive care unit for at least three months until they can go home with their parents. A part of her was relieved that she no longer had to carry her little ones in her womb as they were getting heavy, but at the same time, she was worried about them being born prematurely. You obviously do still worry that they will be fine, she admitted. Unfortunately, Andy was in shock and could not recall his daughter's births. While everyone was preparing for the girl's arrival in the delivery room, it became too much for Andy, who passed out in the delivery room and missed out on the birth of his girls. The dad of four only remembers waking up with a pillow on his head on the delivery room floor after everything was done. He quickly got back up on his feet to show support to his wife and to see his daughters for the first time, and it was an amazing feeling he'd never forget. The babies, whom they named Danny, Stai, Mia, and Taylor, all weighed three olds at the time of their birth. Because they were born premature, they were placed under neonatal care and needed to stay in the neonatal intensive care unit for at least three months until they could go home with their parents. The proud parents didn't live together but applied to their local council for a house that could accommodate their big family. Aside from the four babies, they live with Gemma's daughter from a previous relationship, Millie Grace. Although Donnie, Sky, Mia, and Taylor didn't get to go home right away, Gemma and Andy visited their daughters regularly, applying kangaroo care to them by doing skin-to-skin -skin contact for a couple of minutes. They also prepared for their girls' homecoming by ensuring they had all their needs ready before arrival. One way they prepared was by getting all the baby gear ready. While they initially wanted a stroller that could seat all four babies simultaneously, they knew it wasn't possible. So they settled for two twin strollers instead. More than being ready for all their needs, Gemma had mixed emotions about taking her girls home. She admitted, I'm really looking forward to having all the girls home, but it is quite daunting going from one child to five. Now that they have their hands full, Andy and Gemma will have to juggle caring for their household while maintaining their careers. Andy works in retail, while Gemma has a career in finance. No matter what life has in store for them, being with their five daughters is all that matters and are bound to make anything and everything work for their sake. Andy's most recent update shows Mia, Sky, and Danny all tucked up in their home. He hopes Taylor will join the rest of her siblings as soon as it's safe for her to do so. Click here to read about the extraordinary story of identical twin sisters who married identical twin brothers and are now raising their children in a quaternary marriage.